Minister of National Security, Albert Kandapa, has called for collaborative efforts by state and non-state actors to address the widespread twin threat of terrorism and violent extremism. He has been providing updates on the security situation in the country. The Accra Initiative, established in September 2017, serves as the mechanism to enhance intelligence and security cooperation between the intelligence and security agencies of member states. It was also formed to address the deteriorating security situations in the sub-region. The Executive Secretariat of the Accra Initiative is headquartered in Accra here and operates with personnel from the intelligence services, defense, and security forces provided by all member states of the Accra Initiative. It's to strengthen operational collaboration between member states so that we can prevent terrorists and extremists from taking refuge in a member state so that we can dismantle terrorist networks and prevent the expansion of cells so that we can prevent and, com and combat radicalization and violent extremism and so that we can fight against transnational organized crime. National Security Minister Albert Khan Dapa also called for innovative approaches to address prevailing regional security threats. A border may not be the best way of doing it. But you know, these days you can take advantage of technology. There are a lot of things that uh, can be done. You don't need so many um, numbers of soldiers and immigration officers at the borders. Uh, technology can help us, and we are exploring the various uh, possibilities that exist and have started investing in that area to make sure that we can manage this very, very difficult problem of maintaining the uh, porous uh, borders. According to him, Ghana is well prepared to avert such threats. These people normally take advantage of ungoverned spaces uh, in the countries where they have moved into and have operated. We're making sure that as much as possible, we do not have as many such ungoverned spaces uh, in uh, our country. We also do have the chieftaincy uh, system and where there isn't any government presence per se, you'll find that the traditional rulers also do help a lot. We're taking all these things into account and we're doing our best. We're doing our best to ensure that uh, we do not get uh, attacked. And in the unlikely event that uh, somebody tries to cause confusion in our country, that we would be able to respond uh, effectively. On November 22, 2022, a summit of head of state and government will adopt resolutions to enable the Accra Initiative effectively accelerate the impact.